single day. Hey, Shara Connie, this is Shara Connie Cop Watch. So today we're doing fuck indoctrinating kids into gay communists at schools because sadly that is exactly what they are doing. That's the parents' job, not the school. I would recommend against uh, turning your kid into a gay communist, though. It's a good thing you're out here because this freaking town got a lot of those freaking weirdos that came down from up north and they want to bring all right. the freaking California, New York, and all the shit that didn't work up there. They want to do it down here. I hear you, man. It's ridiculous. A lot, of them, a lot of them are in Punta Gorda. It is sad. Yeah, you know, it's terrible. It is sad. The other day when I was doing it, there was literally communists admitting they were communists. Oh, okay. Okay. There's a communist. I, I redacted it for the kids. Right? I am being good to people. So there's one of them right there. Right have been right in front of you. Look home. at that shit, man. Yeah. Yes, it is yeah. that bad here. It is sad. Yeah, it's it's Punta Gorda, man. It's all these Yankees that come down with all their bullshit from up north. That is correct, man. Punta Gorda Police Department on recorded line. How may I help you? Yes, hi. At the corner of Lashley Park, there's a man standing um, standing there with a large, I won't call it a poster, but you know. He's Printed, printed signage, and it's got profane language on it. He doesn't have a right to stand there with profane language, as far as I know. And Unfortunately, I can it's look, free speech, and my, really nothing we can ahead. do about it. Profane language? He can yeah. stand there with a sign that's got... Mm. All right, well, I believe he's, he might be standing on my property, which is 200 Harbor Walk. He can't stand there. When I come back, if he's standing on my corner, I will call you, or you can check on him now. But you can you can have profane language in public and publish it. It's free is speech, ma'am. No, oh, no, profanity is not free speech. We have some common sense. Okay. It's Do you want me to send an officer out? Now you're saying he's on your property. Ah, uh, yes, I think he is. He's, I'm not there right now, but I'm pretty sure he's right on my corner. So get rid of him. Yes. Walk. On the corner, on the public street, on now, the sidewalk, walk. on the no, sidewalk. If he's on the sidewalk, he's okay. But if he's not on the sidewalk, I can't see him right now. Okay, I well, you're, you're, well, can no, you No, I will call you back when okay. I see where he's at. All right. That's fine. Yeah, call us back Common if he's sense. on your property. Public speech does not include profanity. Public speech does not include sending threats to people. He's, you know, he's got, like, threatening language on there. It's threatening. He's got a picture of Hitler. He's got a picture of what? Hitler. Adolf Hitler. Okay, and why is that against the law? I'm just telling you what's on the poster. Okay, and I'm just trying to find out why you're calling it that's against, that you say that's against the law, that he can't have it. I said I said the F word and profanity certainly is not within his right to throw it around. You want to have a legal discussion here? I can certainly discuss it with someone. You know, we all don't have a right to, to you don't have a right to threaten people. You know that. Okay. Well, he's you, right. You threaten, you threaten people online? You can't I don't know. You're, you you're, you're, you're telling me you're I'm not, not there, so you. you don't know exactly where it is. So when you get there, well, give us I a went, call back and we'll send somebody out to see you. Right. I'm sorry that you don't think that bad language, that language that is threatening, is certainly inappropriate. So okay. Fine. Like I said, Thank when you. you get back there and you are there, give us a call and we'll send somebody out to see you. Good. Okay. Thank you. Okay. All right. Bye-bye.